how to use fresh desk for your customer service hi guys welcome back today i'm going to be showing you how you can use fresh desk to improve your customer service what are the different features and tools we get on fresh desk to create an amazing customer service that helps us grow our business and provide the best customer service out there so let's get started First, what you have to do is you will simply go to freshdesk.com and you will land on this platform right here. Freshdesk is provided by Freshworks, which is a world known platform that helps you create your own CRM, sales, and marketing as well. With Freshdesk, you will get a lot of different features, such as support desk, messaging, contact center, and customer success. Simply sign up for Freshdesk. Once you sign up with your Google account, this is where you will land. This is my fresh desk dashboard. In here, we get the option of dashboard. Then we have our tickets, contacts, social, solution, forums, chat box, and report. Let's go ahead and explore them one by one. So let's go ahead and create a contact. So you will simply go right here and click on contact. In here, you will be able to find all of your contacts that you have created. You will be able to import a list from your sheet or from your Gmail as well. And you can also export a contact as well. To create a new contact, you simply click on this new option right here. Then select new contact. Now, simply add full name, title, email address, phone number, Twitter. And then you have to add their company. And then you can also select a time zone, language. You can add tags and description. Once you're done with all of the details, you simply click on create and a new contact is created. So this is my new contact. Now I can go ahead and edit my contact, delete it, merge with another contact, assume identity, convert to an agent send activation email or change password for this person as well i will be able to check the details right here the email address time zone language and twitter now i can add a new ticket for my contact right here that i have just added to add a new ticket you will simply click on this option right here or you can go to tickets as well but i'm going to show you how to create a new ticket and forum right here Click on new ticket and it will take you to tickets option. You add contact, subject, select the type, then select the source, status, priority. I'm going to keep it high priority. Select the group. This is customer support, agent. You can select an agent as well. Then simply add a description for your ticket. You can also go ahead and add a tag here. The good thing is we also get ticket templates. So if you want to select a template, you can go ahead and select any template that is available, such as initiate a refund. And this is what the template looks like. You can see right here, all of the options will be filled. Then simply click on create and your new ticket is created. You can see right here, this is what it will look like. And it is very professional. Now this is my new ticket that I have created and I will be able to check my due date and my you know response right here. Now I can simply go back to the contact and I will open up my contact that I just created. So now you can see we have a ticket created for this person. Initiate a refund. Then we have notes. In here I can simply go ahead and add notes for this contact right here. I can write anything in my notes. And simply click on add note and a new note will be added. Then we have forums. We can create a new forum right here to start a conversation. Then we have archived tickets right here. So this is how a contact works on Fresh Desk. I can also go ahead and now edit the contact or maybe change password. Then I can go to companies. Let's say that you are working for companies. Adding a company is also really easy. Simply click on new, go to new company, and you will be able to add a new company right here. 
add the name, simply add description, notes, domain, health source, account tire, renewal date, industry, and then simply click on create. Once you click on create, a new company is created. And now again, I can edit it out or delete it. I can add create a new ticket for my company as well. Creating a ticket is super easy. You can also create a ticket from here or maybe from this option right here. Then we have archive tickets and notes. Let's go to forums. So this is our forum right here. And in here, you will be able to check all of your, your activity, your replies, your new messages or reporting a problem. You will also be able to check the announcements, feature requests, tips and tricks, report a problem, and sales and offer. To add a new topic, you simply click on Add Topic. Type in the topic name, such as Invitation. Then you will simply type in the description, select a forum, an announcement, and post topic. Your new topic will be added right here on your forums. You can see right here. You can also edit your topic, mark as spam, or log topic, or merge topic. Then we have our chat bots available as well. On Freshdesk, we get all of the features and tools that, that someone will look for in a customer service platform. We are also getting our bots that actually help us customize and personalize our resolutions to our customers. You can simply go to Manage Bots, and you will be able to add new bots to your chat bots right here. Then I can simply go to my dashboard and it will give me all of my review right here. You can check your reports and analytics with this option right here. If we go to analytics, it will give me an overview that what's happening on my fresh desk and I will be able to check all of the details such as my activity, new and old notifications. We can also create an email with our fresh desk. As I showed you how to create a new ticket, new contact, a new company, we can also create a new email. So it will be very easy. Simply add from to subject description and priority status and tag. Then you can send it right now or schedule it for later. You can also go ahead and add your subscription list right here or import your list from your Gmail. And this is how we simply use Fresh Desk for our customer service. I hope this video was a big help to you and now you know how to use Fresh Desk. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.